the hellfire has different names with different descriptions that are mentioned in the Islamic tradition. Amongst the names of the hellfire are Jahim because of its blazing fire, Jahannam because of the depth of its pit, Lada because of its blazing flames, Saqar because of the intensity of its heat, Hatama because it breaks and crushes anything to debris that is thrown into it, Hawiyah because whoever is thrown into it is thrown from the top to the deep bottom of its chasm or abyss. The dwellers of the hellfire will be made huge, so every part of their body can feel the punishment. A person's molar tooth will be as big as Mount Uhud, a mountain in the city of Medina. The distance between the shoulders of the dwellers of the hell will be equivalent to three days of walking. The fire that exists and burns in this world we live in today is one seventieth of the severity and intensity of the hellfire in the hereafter. The fire kindled by the Almighty will burn the skin of its inhabitants, and every time their skin gets roasted, their skin will melt into their feet, and God will replace their burnt skin with a new one to be burnt again, and the process will keep on repeating so they may taste the punishment. Other forms of punishment include superheated scalding burning oil, which will be poured on their head, which will melt away and liquefy their internal organs. The inhabitants of the hellfire will be seized by chains and shackles, which will be tied around their necks and feet. Indeed, we have prepared for the disbelievers chains and shackles and blaze. The clothing in the hellfire will be garments of fire tailored for them with copper, so they will boil inside of it. The Qur'an references three types of food in the hellfire, which in fact worsen a sinner's torment when consumed. The food and drink of the hellfire do not provide nourishment, nor does it relieve hunger nor thirst. The dwellers of the hellfire will experience intense thirst, only to have hot boiling water given to them. Water so hot and intense that if a drop of it touches a mountain of this world today, it would turn it into dust. Amongst the food of the dwellers of the hellfire is the tree of Zakum, located in the lowest level of hell. Its branches are described like head of devils. Its vicious fruit severely burn the inside of a sinner's stomach. If a drop of its juice lands on earth, it would poison the whole earth and everything it contains. Our prophet narrated, whoever guides another to a good deed will get a reward similar to the one who performs it. So please like, subscribe, and share this video. Assalamu alaikum.